Look up, what do you see? The vast expanse of the night sky, dotted with countless stars, planets, and celestial wonders. If you're lucky and the sky is clear, you'll see the moon, our closest celestial neighbor, shining brightly. It's a beacon in the night, a silvery disk that has fascinated humanity since we first looked up at the stars. Its glow has inspired countless stories, poems, and songs. For millennia, the moon has been a source of wonder, myth, and inspiration. Ancient civilizations built monuments aligned with its phases, and cultures around the world wove it into their legends and lore. It's a celestial timekeeper, marking the passage of months with its ever-changing phases. From the new moon to the full moon, its cycle is a reliable measure of time. It's a silent guardian, its gravitational pull shaping the rhythms of our world. The tides of our oceans rise and fall in response to its presence, influencing marine life and coastal ecosystems. But have you ever stopped to wonder where did the moon come from? What cosmic events led to its formation? How did this celestial object become our constant companion in the vastness of space? Its journey is one of the most intriguing stories in our solar system. The moon's story is a dramatic one, filled with cosmic collisions and fiery creation. Scientists believe it was born from a colossal impact between the young Earth and a Mars-sized body named Theia. It's a story deeply intertwined with our own, for without the moon, life on Earth might have taken a very different course. Its presence has been crucial in stabilizing our planet's tilt and climate. The moon isn't just a pretty face in the night sky. Its surface, marked by craters and ancient lava plains, tells a tale of a turbulent past. It's a vital part of our planet's story, a key player in the intricate dance of life and the cosmos. Its light has guided travelers and its cycles have influenced human behavior and agriculture. In the grand tapestry of the universe, the Earth-Moon system stands out as something truly special. The unique relationship between our planet and its satellite has shaped the evolution of life on Earth. It's a testament to the power of cosmic events to shape worlds and influence the course of life. The Moon's gravitational influence has played a role in the development of Earth's seasons and weather patterns, and as we delve deeper into the Moon's origins, we'll uncover not just the story of our celestial companion, but also gain a deeper understanding of our own place in the universe. The Moon, with its silent presence, continues to be a source of curiosity and exploration, reminding us of the vastness and wonder of the cosmos. Our journey to the Moon has only just begun. With each mission, we uncover new secrets and deepen our connection to this ancient celestial body. The moon holds the key to many mysteries, both about itself and our own planet. As we look to the future, the moon may become a stepping stone for further space exploration. Imagine a future where humans live and work on the moon, using it as a base to explore the deeper reaches of our solar system. The moon continues to inspire the next generation of dreamers and explorers. Its presence in the night sky is a constant reminder of the endless possibilities that lie beyond our world. From ancient calendars to modern space missions, the moon has always been a part of our journey. Its story is our story, a testament to the enduring bond between Earth and its luminous companion. So next time you look up at the night sky and see the moon, remember the incredible journey it has taken to be there. It's more than just a familiar face, it's a symbol of our past, present and future in the cosmos. To understand the moon's birth, we need to rewind the cosmic clock back to a time when our solar system was young. This was an era of immense transformation where the very fabric of space was being woven with the threads of gravity and time. Imagine, if you will, a swirling cloud of gas and dust, a nebula teeming with the raw ingredients of planets, moons and stars. This nebula was a vast cosmic nursery where the seeds of celestial bodies were sown waiting to be nurtured by the forces of nature. This was the solar nebula, the birthplace of our sun and its orbiting family. Within this stellar nursery, the sun began to form, igniting a chain reaction that would lead to the creation of the entire solar system. Within this chaotic cloud, gravity was hard at work. It was the invisible hand guiding particles together, shaping the destiny of countless celestial bodies. It pulled particles together, coaxing them into larger and larger clumps. These clumps, driven by the relentless force of gravity, began to grow. 
merging and colliding in a dance of cosmic proportions. Over millions of years, these clumps grew into planetesimals, the building blocks of planets. These planetesimals were the precursors to the planets we know today, each one a potential world in the making. It was a time of intense bombardment as these planetary embryos jostled for position, colliding and coalescing in a cosmic ballet of creation and destruction. Each collision was a step in the grand dance of planetary formation, a process that would take eons to complete. The early solar system was a chaotic and violent place, a far cry from the relatively peaceful arrangement we see today. It was a time of great upheaval where the forces of nature were in constant conflict, shaping the future of our cosmic neighborhood. It was within this turbulent environment that the seeds of the moon's formation were sown. The moon's story begins here in the midst of this cosmic chaos, where the building blocks of our satellite were first assembled. A young Earth, still glowing from its recent formation, was about to experience a close encounter that would forever alter its destiny. This encounter, a cataclysmic collision with a Mars-sized body, would give birth to the moon, setting the stage for the next chapter in the story of our solar system. In the vastness of space, encounters between celestial objects are inevitable. Some are fleeting, a mere gravitational tug as objects pass in the night. Others, however, are far more dramatic, and in Earth's early history, one such encounter would change everything. A Mars-sized object, which scientists have named Theia, was on a collision course with our young planet. We don't know the exact details of Theia's journey, but we can imagine it hurtling through the early solar system, perhaps nudged by the gravitational pull of Jupiter or another giant planet. Whatever the reason, its path was set, a collision course with the still-forming Earth. The stage was set for a cosmic cataclysm, an event so powerful it would forge the moon and shape the destiny of our planet. Section 4. A Dance of Destruction. The giant impact that birthed the moon. The collision between Earth and Theia was nothing short of spectacular. This cataclysmic event, occurring over 4.5 billion years ago, was a pivotal moment in the early solar system's history. Imagine two celestial objects, each glowing with the heat of their formation, slamming into each other at unimaginable speeds. Theia, a Mars-sized protoplanet, and the early Earth, both on their own unique paths, were destined to collide in a dramatic and violent encounter. The energy released was beyond comprehension, unleashing a fiery inferno that vaporized rock and metal, sending molten debris hurtling outwards in a colossal cosmic explosion. The sheer force of the impact was enough to melt the outer layers of both planets, creating a sea of molten rock and metal. The impact wasn't a head-on collision, but rather a glancing blow. This off-center collision was crucial in determining the outcome of this cosmic event. This is crucial because a direct impact would have obliterated both Earth and Theia, leaving behind little more than a scattered cloud of debris. Instead, the glancing blow allowed for a more controlled dispersal of material. Instead, the glancing blow created a disk of molten rock and vaporized material that circled the Earth. This disk, composed of the remnants of both Earth and Theia, began to coalesce under the influence of gravity. This disk, a swirling ring of cosmic debris, held the key to the moon's formation. Over time, the particles within this disk began to collide and stick together, gradually forming larger and larger clumps. The impact that created the moon was a defining moment in our planet's history. It set the stage for the development of a stable satellite that would have profound effects on Earth's future. It was a dance of destruction on a colossal scale, but from the chaos, a new world would emerge. The moon, born from the remnants of this cataclysmic event, would go on to play a crucial role in stabilizing Earth's axial tilt, influencing tides, and even affecting the evolution of life on our planet. As the debris continued to coalesce, the moon began to take shape. This process, known as accretion, saw the gradual gathering of material into a single cohesive body. The newly formed moon, still glowing from its recent birth, orbited close to the Earth. Over millions of years, it would move further away, settling into the orbit we see today. The giant impact hypothesis remains one of the most compelling explanations for the moon's origin, providing insight into the dynamic and often violent processes that shaped our early solar system. The moon's formation is a testament to the incredible forces at play in the universe. 
and a reminder of the interconnectedness of all celestial bodies. Section 5. Out of the Chaos. The Moon Takes Shape. In the aftermath of the giant impact, the Earth was a very different place. Its surface was a molten sea of magma, and the newly formed debris disk circled the planet, glowing with the heat of the impact. This wasn't just a ring of rock and dust, it was the raw material from which the moon would be born. Within the disk, gravity once again began to exert its influence. Particles collided and stuck together, gradually forming larger and larger clumps. Over time, these clumps coalesced into moonlets, mini-moons orbiting the still cooling Earth. The process continued, driven by gravity's relentless pull, until only one large body remained, our moon. The moon, born from the fiery chaos of the giant impact, began its long journey as Earth's celestial companion. Section 6. A lunar canvas scars of a violent past. The early moon was a world in turmoil. Its surface was a molten ocean, bombarded by the constant rain of leftover debris from the impact. As the moon cooled and solidified, these impacts left their mark, creating the craters that define its landscape today. Unlike Earth, where erosion and geological activity have erased most traces of its early bombardment, the moon's surface bears witness to its violent past. Each crater tells a story, a silent testament to the chaotic early days of the solar system. These craters, ranging in size from small pop marks to vast impact basins, paint a vivid picture of the moon's tumultuous early years. The moon's cratered surface serves as a reminder of the dynamic nature of our solar system, where collisions both large and small have shaped the worlds we see today.